In this video tutorial, I'm not going to go how to about about how to install Android Studio. Or just make sure that you uh, that you have the Android Pad set up and the, the the platform tools folder added to the Pad variable. We will continue by installing Node.js. Download from the from this official website the long term uh, support version, and then download Appium installer for Windows. You'll find it in the just follow the link as in the video. Then go download Python uh, version 2.7. I'm not going to download those files because I've already done it. So do do it and follow along with me. I've already installed uh, Node.js, so I'm not going to do it. Do it. It's uh, it's straightforward and follow with me. I'm going to install Appium now. Uh, it's simple just click the executable file and follow along with the weather will it uh, will it up your download the libraries and the packages and we go to install python it's also a straightforward operation just click the executable and the follow along just we have to verify something uh, in the the weather so click next then then choose to to add python to the pad so you don't have to do it manually when you choose this option and click next appium takes time to download the packages I'm going to skip the file copying part. After installing Node.js, Python, and Appium, we are ready to install Robot Framework. We're going to do that via command line and using pipe. So to, to install robot framework type install a uh, pipe install robot framework and hit enter and voila it's going to download it and and install it so the installation has been successfully now we're going to move to, to install appium library we do that by typing pipe install robot framework hyphen Appium library Oops, I made a typo I'm going to correct it So here we start again. So robot framework Appium library is installing it dependencies.
so the installation has been successfully completed now we are ready to write automated tests just by using a text file and running it from command line by typing by boot and the name of the file or the path of the file this way of doing it is is not convenient so there is another way uh, which is better which consists of using write write an IDE that makes it easy to write automated testing using a graphical interface to to install it go to the link as as in the video and follow the instruction that are here ride uses wx python the toolkit for its GUI so we have to download it and install it to be able to use ride So click download the exact version that I'm showing you here. This one, download this one. I've already downloaded, so I'm going to, to install it. It's super easy. Just click the executable and follow along with the wizard. Wizard. Next, next. So now we're going to install the ride. We, we will do that from the command line by typing this command pipe install robot framework hyphen ride. The installation has been successfully completed. So now to run write IDE, we have we need just to type write one pi dot pi. In Ride, we can organize our uh, our test project in in a project, and inside the project we can make uh, test cases, and each test case contains a number of test cases. So our project will be a directory named first test. And we will add to our directory or our project a test suite and inside the test the test suite we're going to, uh, to make a test case
Now we are ready to write automated tests using keywords such as open application, which is defined in Appium library. But before we can use them, we have to import the library. We'll see how to do that in the next video. Thank you for watching this tutorial.